dogfighting operations busted today. The latest tonight in West Philadelphia, where investigators found a basement full of pit bulls trained to fight to the death. NBC 10 Sydney Long is live at police headquarters with tonight's raid, as well as another bust in Chester County earlier today. Sydney. Investigators, at least right now, don't have reason to believe that these two massive dogfighting operations are connected. But say inside both homes, they seized an enormous amount of evidence. And a warning tonight, some of the video you're about to see, you may find disturbing. Uh, this is, I mean, it's a felony, uh, you know, just to possess uh, fighting dogs. Uh, these dogs were uh, scarred up pretty good. Pit bulls, authorities say, were trained by their owners to attack and kill, were rescued Wednesday night by the Pennsylvania SPCA. Only NBC10 was there as a West Philadelphia man was taken into custody for allegedly running an elaborate dog fighting ring in the basement of his row home. Uh, in the basement, uh, we found numerous fighting dogs uh, and training equipment, uh, along with uh, a lot of drugs and jackpot. And so forth. Authorities believe two other individuals are in hiding along with additional dogs and they anticipate more charges and tonight's arrest. What we found was a nightmare. Follows the bust of a Chester County couple, Shane Santiago and Laura Acampora of West Brandywine. This is a dog that has been tortured. Who authorities say ran a vicious, large-scale dog breeding, fighting, and killing ring in the basement of their rental home that they shared with five children, attracting out-of-state dog owners to fight there, complete with a treadmill, chains, jumper cables to electrocute the animals, and cables used to strangle them if they lose. That residence was a house of pain and horror for the dogs that live there. Detectives began investigating Santiago on drug-related offenses and grew suspicious of the couple when neighbors reported injured dogs coming out of the home. In September, authorities discovered a pit bull they believed doused in gasoline and burned alive, dead in a cage on the side of the road they believed to be linked to Santiago. And in all, nine dogs have been rescued, six from the Chester County home and three in West Philadelphia. All are now in the care of the SPCA. Santiago and Acampura will have their first court appearance on Friday morning. Live at police headquarters, I'm Sydney Long, NBC 10 News.